Koulibaly that. might be sold by Napoli. Another guy, Man City is interested. Koulibaly has not had a good year for Napoli. My no. question is, uh, aging player that this season has done very poorly. Napoli need the, the money. Would you sell Koulibaly for 70 million so that you could buy oh, somebody heartbeat. younger? In a heartbeat. Even for 60, 50. All right. He's one of the top defenders, Anto. It could change, though, the dynamic of your team, depending what squad, because... Liverpool, when they got Virgil van Dijk, everybody said, whoa, mm -hmm. that's too much money. You're crazy. I can't believe that for a center back. Sure. He changed the entire back line. I love Koulibaly. For me, he was one of the best defenders in the world a couple of years ago. He was top, 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 top. I think at this point, very scary how he declined this year. And I know it was an off year for all of Napoli. They did not have good, a good moment. But I do think that this is your last moment. And De Laurentiis Seven. is probably looking Seven. at this and saying, "This is if he has one more bad year, you're not even going to get 50 million from next year. Mm -hmm. No. He's going to probably pushing 30 yeah. around there. Yeah, this, this, this is, is the last time they right sell. This, uh, I'm going to check right now. I think he's 29. 28 or 29, yeah. Do you think right. that Koulibaly oozes that confidence? Because that's where a team would pay for that to control your back line. Because I'll, I'll use yeah. Liverpool again as an example with mm -hmm. Virgil van Dijk. Because he has this confidence, this presence, both the fullbacks are on board with that. Robertson, you had the young Trent Alexander Arnold at the time. These guys are like, okay, this is our leader on the back, and now we got the most out of them. Yeah. Liverpool maximized yeah. both their fullbacks, who are both like arguably the two mm -hmm. best fullbacks in the game. I think Liverpool's like situation is very different from Napoli's. So that would be my only answer. Is like Napoli, I think that it's too much of a risk for them to not sell Koulibaly at this point. No, I'm not talking about anything selling from Liverpool. I, I, I'm talking about when Liverpool brought in Virgil, he had the, the leadership qualities to not only improve the other center back, but the other defenders around him developed talent. So it was a great investment. If Koulibaly could give that to a team, that gives you a lot more value where you take the big transfer. That was mm -hmm, supposed definitely. to be the idea with Napoli. Was They signed Manolas, who was supposed to... Manolas was one of the top defenders for Roma. Whoa. Was one of the top <laughs> That's what he was said. That's what he said. One of the top I believe my words are. And it was supposed to be, we were here saying Koulibaly and, and Manolas are going to be the two best center backs of the league. Because yeah, on paper, that. it was supposed to work out. And it did not work out nope. in any fashion. Do you think it worked out? I don't think anyone thinks it worked out.